Yeah. May I suggest using a nice stick, officer? Get out of here! Mr. Valentine, could you spare us a moment? Hey, man, don't I know you two guys? Step inside. Nice and warm in here. Whiskey. All you want. Hey, look, man, I ain't falling for the same trick twice, all right? What you gonna do, get me in the car and have me arrested for stealing it? Why should we do that, Mr. Valentine? We're the ones who bailed you out. Hey, man, who are y'all? What y'all want with me? We want to help you, Mr. Valentine. My brother and I run a privately funded program to rehabilitate culturally disadvantaged people. We'd like to supply you with a home of your own, a car, a generous bank account, and employment with our company. We're going to start you at $80,000 a year. $80,000? Mm. Excuse me. This is a practical joke, right, bro? Then these dudes a couple of faggots in, huh? Well, what's my next move, man? Thank you, you've been helpful. What about the police and the payroll? We've had the charges dropped, Mr. Valentine. You're a free man, Valentine. We can stop right now and you can walk out on us forever. No. No, I believe I can hang out with you fellas for a little while. Excellent. Yeah. I'm Randolph Duke. How you doing, Randy? What's happening? My younger brother, Mortimer. Hey, Marte, what it is? <laughs> Billy Ray Valentine, Capricorn. <laughs> Randy, that's like Randy Jackson from the Jackson 5, right? Uh, yes. Uh, yes, I suppose so. Yeah. <laughs> This is Coleman. He'll look after your day-to-day -day needs. Can I relieve you of those, sir? Uh... Uh, you get a glass, I'll give you a sip, man. Yeah, perhaps your coat, sir. Uh, yes, this is my coat. Uh, Coleman is here to take care of you. He is your servant. But may I take it? Get out of here, man. Valentine very badly wants to take a hot bath and to get into something comfortable. Don't you, Valentine? Jacuzzi, sir. You see, man, I knew y'all was faggots, man. You ain't jacuzzi nobody. It's a whirlpool bath, sir. I think you'll enjoy it. Hey, hey, bubbles, man. Say, man, when I was growing up, we wanted jacuzzi, we had to fart in the tub. This is bad. <laughs> when you think of... What's he doing in there? He's uh, singing, sir. They're very musical people, aren't they? What shall I do with his uh, his clothes, sir? Send them to the laundry. He'll have to have something to wear back to the ghetto after I've won our bet. Well, William, what do you think? I like it, Randy. It's very nice. I like the way you got the marriage and stuff hooked up over there. It's very pretty. I like that. I like that. Yeah, I don't think he understands, Randolph. Oh, but Marty, I do understand. Uh, I William. Do. Yes. 
This is your home. Uh huh. Right. It, it belongs to you. Yeah, all this is mine. I like my home. It's very nice. That's very nice tasting houses. I like Everything it. you see in this room is yours now. Uh huh. This is my stuff. Your own personal property? Yeah, my own personal shit. You understand? This is mine. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, you know what I like most about my place, Randy? The curtains, man. Look at the curtains. It's beautiful the way I got this place set up, man. This is something else. I like it. The cabinets and whatnot. Beautiful. I suppose uh, you're going to just give me this TV set for free, huh, Randy? That's right. Uh huh. Everything in here is mine, huh? Oh, I guess the cereal is mine free, too, huh? Absolutely. This is too much for me, man. You know, I can really dig this, Randy. You know why? This kind of thing happens to me every week. This is your house. These are your personal possessions. You will only be stealing from yourself. Look, first you throw my ass in jail, right? Then you're gonna drive me out here and start running some garbage to me about this is my house, this is my personal rug, and then you're gonna tell me this is my personal slave, too. I understand how you feel, William, but the fact remains, all this is yours. You may do with it whatever you wish. This is my stuff in my place, huh? I can do what I want with this stuff, right? This, this is my vase here, right? This is Billy Ray's vase, right? I own this vase, and I can play like Harlem Globe try to shit with it, right? Okay, you want Miller Lemon shit, right? <laughs> hey, man, I'm sorry about that. Perfectly all right, William. It was your vase. That's a cheap vase, man. That was a fake, right? I think we paid $35,000 for it. But I seem to remember we estimated its value at $50,000 for the insurance company. <laughs> you see, Mortimer, William has already made us a profit of $15,000. <laughs> you want me to break something else? No. <laughs>